Hi everyone, welcome back to another edition of the Velvet Lounge Life. It's been a while since I received any mail and I was pleasantly, happily surprised to receive two packages. So I wanted to just quickly open these up so that you could see what's in them. Um, and yay. And like I said before, I am ever so grateful anytime you guys send me anything. I really appreciate it. Thank you so much for supporting the channel by subscribing, leaving comments, giving videos a thumbs up, and also sharing them is incredibly important. We are creeping towards our goal of 1,000 subscribers. Please help me get there. I cannot do it without you. Thank you so much for everything you've done. So without further ado, here we go. And also, I'm holding the camera with one hand, so I will have to like pause, open a package, and move on like that. So I opened this one first. And I could hear, like, if I shook the package, I could hear that there was something inside. And let me rip this tape off and show you what's in there. And there is a box that was inside of the package. The box is kind of like folded down and folded over, which was a great idea. That's the thing that people forget is you can mail boxes inside of envelopes. It was folded down sort of like that and had this tape going across. So the good thing about that, it saves you in postage cost. I love smart people. And when I opened it, there are all of these I'll pour them out. Varied colored buttons. And I think that I'm, I have to look these up. I actually have a chart, but I recognized instantly that some of these are cult buttons. That's C O L T. The same people that made the cult firearms in Hartford, Connecticut. They also made um, buttons, of course, probably due to a war effort or, you know, they had to change focus due to business interest or whatever it is. I never did any research on them. I should. Um, but, yeah, I recognize several of these as probably being cult buttons. So I really appreciate that. And also, which when I poured this stuff out of the box, I noticed this. There's this charm. Let me see if it does have a marking on it. It says 14 karat gold. It's 14 karat gold. Wow. That is a really generous gift. I appreciate it, Mr. C. Thank you so, so much. Um, it's a starfish, but I also love the colors and all of these buttons, and they will definitely go towards several projects um, over time that I work on. Um, you know, I just really appreciate it. Thank you, thank you, thank you. So let's get to the next package. I just want to get back to these buttons quickly because as I was putting them in the box, I noticed that this there's six of these, and they say Mucklux, and Mucklux is the name of a footwear maker. They make, like, mostly boots or boot style um, footwear, and definitely boots for sure. So, super cool. I have an excellent idea for these. They're, like, the size of a half dollar or 50 cent piece. So I have an amazing idea that I'm going to use those for. So thank you again, Mr. C. And here is the next package I took out of the larger package. So let me unwrap this. So, like I said, I'm working with one hand. So I had to struggle to get the tape off, which is just my one-handed situation right now. And this came from my pen pal, 
and she's always amazing, awesome. Thank you, thank you, thank you, Ms. S. You know who you are. And of course, you know me still doing this. Wow, this is a pretty, am it's sort of like an amber colored button. It's made of glass, two holes, as you can see, and it's molded. So all of this is like a raised decoration. It's really pretty. And yes, of course you know me, this is going into one of my projects, maybe a charm string, I'm not sure, but definitely beautiful button. My photography is definitely not doing it any justice, so please forgive me for that, let me see. And this button, it's about the size of, I would say a quarter or one of those Susan B. Anthony coins. That's what it reminds me of. Yes, my hands are a mess from gardening. And this is a finger that still still it's healing from when I had the eight stitches in this finger. So it looks pretty horrible. And there's, ooh, look at this. A nice, big, shiny, blinged out buckle but I think I have an idea for this I think and yes these stones are glued in so one of the things I did is I glued in stones or of course the prong set ones um, are another method but in later years of course gluing in was much quicker much easier so you know that's what they did and let's see what the back looks like. That's the back. And let hold on for one minute. So, I have an idea. As you can see, I am going to use this as a slide for my longer scarves. So, thank you so much, Mrs. S. Or Ms. S. Um, right now it's summer here, so definitely as soon as it's cool enough, early fall, this will definitely grease several of my scarves. And I'm so happy I have an, an everyday practical use for it and I don't need to create a project. So thank you so, 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 so much. So thank you guys so much for sending in, um, you know, your messages, your emails. Obviously, I love receiving different things in the U.S. Postal Service via FedEx, UPS. Love it, love it, love it. It's like, you know, the surprise that keeps me motivated, keeps me going. And also, once again, for subscribing to my channel, please remember to share um, the videos if you're in different Facebook groups or if you're on Instagram and like one of my button videos um, is something that you can reference or simply share with people, the playlist, I would really appreciate that. I'm trying to remain active with um, YouTube and of course, the less active you are, the lower in the search um, your videos are, and that makes me super sad. So <laughs> thank you guys for making me really happy today. Be well, stay well. Remember that your health is your wealth, and without your health, you have absolutely nothing. So please take care. Thank you.